God is good. I came here as a student. And uh, I heard the testimony of someone, another lady that was a student. The pastor said, God will change this your green passport Hallelujah. to British passport. I kid him. I said, God can do it for her. God will do it for me. And then in my dream, I saw pastor. He said, come and sing. I said, how will I come and sing with all these my kids? Who will take care of them? And then I kept giving him excuse. I said, no, maybe next month. Oh, maybe okay, like that. And then one day I said, let me take a step of faith. And I started singing. And one day, Pastor said, there's this man that brought uh, the lawyer. Um, indefinitely, there was so much. I was standing while I was going to give testimony. And Sister Harriet said, Opie, oh, won't you grab one? I was looking at it, my mind wasn't with that. I quickly grabbed one. And I said, God, one day I will testify. And Pastor did a program, how can this be? It looked impossible. Sometimes when you're praying, you're like, when will this prayer be answered? And Pastor did that program, I was sitting down, then we were still using the deliverance church. It looked like it was very long, but God shortened it. I said, God, when you do this for me, I will come and I will testify. This, how can this be? You will make it be. My lawyer was telling me what to say. It looked like, God, would this be possible? But no one was sitting down there. Somebody came and said, ah, do you know that the, the judge in this room is a very wicked judge? He does not give anybody any visa. Everybody is refusing. And that is the court where they will do my hair. I said, that means I don't have any hope. Why we were still sitting down there? Like after 10 minutes, another lawyer came and said, do you know that they have moved that judge to another courtroom? Yeah. So, Jesus, I said, now we have only the home office uh, lawyer to contend with. And while we were still standing there again, the next five minutes, another lawyer came again and told us that the home office lawyer said, seek leave. Yeah. He was and that because there was short notice, no home office lawyer to replace him. So I will just be going in with just me and my lawyer. And they replaced the wicked job with a very kind job. So it was just three of us. And when I stepped in, he said, make yourself comfortable. I sat down. And the two documents he brought out from my document, one was later I got from VPA church, and then my certificate. He said, do you go to this church? That was the first question he asked me. I said, yes, I attend the church with my children. He nodded his head. And then he said, my lawyer was not saying everything good about him. There was no negative. And then he just, but it, it was, he didn't want to hear anymore. And he said, he will hear from us in the next three weeks. And that was it. And after three weeks, God gave me my decision. I just want to say thank you for this good, great God. I just want to say if you have come here, just align yourself. Stay focused. Don't be distracted. If you know why you are here, focus on why you are here.